Good morning, mountain riders. Wayne from America Rides Maps, and we are riding US 276. It's a Sunday morning. It is about 10 a.m., and we are gambling that an early run will help us beat the traffic. 276 is uh, well, a really nice ride. Climbs from Waynesville up to the parkway, then back down to Brevard. Lots of twists and turns. The north side by Waynesville generally is uh, pretty benign. Not much traffic over there. Once you get up to the parkway and start down the other side of Brevard, uh, things change. This side of the, uh, the road has uh, a lot of attractions along it. You've got uh, looking glass falls, sliding rock, uh, pink beds, the uh, Forest Discovery Center, numerous hiking trails, horse trails, great fishing streams. So it draws a, you know, a lot of people out, particularly on a nice warm weekend like this in June. So it can be kind of a handful to ride on a Sunday, particularly once you get down around uh, Sliding Rock. There's limited parking, so people kind of do the best they can alongside the road and then walk down the road to get to the waterfall where they like to swim. And so it can get pretty congested. But it looks like this morning we're we're doing pretty good so far. Hopefully we're going to beat all that. We'll know in just a minute as we round the corner. Well, actually, we already know. Later in the day, there will be cars parked, you know, a half a mile, maybe a mile in either direction, wherever they can find a spot. But look at that. Sailed right through. Not a problem. Glass Creek over along the road on the right side here. You hop that back and forth a couple of times on the way down. Once you get down low, it generally stays on the uh, the right side of the, the road. So we're coming up on Looking Glass Falls here, and at that point, it's on the left. It's one of the uh, easiest waterfalls to see. Uh, this morning we were riding that sightseeing, so we're going to blow right past it. But it's a good stop. There's a, uh, a boardwalk that goes down to the falls. Oh, I don't think you can see it from here. It's like a 40, 50 foot drop, maybe 60 foot. Definitely worth seeing. Lots of parking along the roadside because it will fill up later in the day. As you can see, uh, the unofficial parking goes on for quite a ways. See the creek over there? And that's Fish Hatchery Road on the right. It leads out to uh, the fish hatchery, a couple hikes up on the Looking Glass Rock, and then it turns into a nice forest road. There's a waterfall or two down there. Take a little bit of hiking to see. It's a worthwhile trip. And from here on out, uh, US 276 relaxes, gets kind of straight. Um, goes along the river in places, the scenic. There's a campground. There's an old historic church, uh, ranger station. picnic area, obviously. But it's generally uh, just an easy, easy ride into Brevard from here. So if you're planning on doing 276, I 
recommended earlier in the day so you beat the traffic. Um, you might even want to avoid it on a Sunday, although we've gotten fairly lucky this Sunday. Holidays are going to be different, of course. Three-day weekend's going to be different. But it's, uh, don't let the traffic put you off. It's really a good ride. It's really pretty. And you should do this one. You find it on, uh, map number six. Map 100 rides in the Smokies. Map OR2 for you off-road riders. Lots of good trails around here. And you can follow us on YouTube and Instagram. Particularly on Facebook, really active there. And you can always get your maps at americaridesmaps.com. On to the rest of the ride from here. Enjoy.